Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. A brand new model Lexi has dropped. In this video, we are going to install this Lexi model locally and then we will play around with it. This model is totally uncensored and based on Llama 3.1 8 billion. We have already covered Llama 3.1 almost to the death now because I think I already have done more than 60 to 70 videos on Llama 3.1 just in the last one and a half month and it's been fabulous model. Llama 3.1 I believe is one of the highly performant cost effective lightweight ultra fast model at the moment which you can run anywhere because it comes in a lot of sizes like 8 billion, 70 billion and 405 billion. But this model, which is Lexi Uncensored, has been fine-tuned of Llama 3.18 billion, plus they have used Unsloth in order to fine-tune it. A fun fact, Lexi comes from the Greeks, and Lexi primarily uh, is a shortened form of the name Alexandra, which means defender of the people in Greek. I'm not sure what is the correlation of this name with this model, but maybe it is defending something. It is quite compliant model, it is quite smart, it is not um, fully yet evaluated on a whole lot of benchmarks but on Vino Grande benchmark it has compared to the original Instruct model which is Llama 3.1 and the performance is quite good and not above original one but quite close which is quite a good feat. Also uh, it things step by step with a logical reasoning and intellectual sense is quite there and we are going to also check it out in our testing. Also if you want to get um, more uncensored and compliant responses you can alter the system message as per your own. Also um, if you are using the quantized version there are sometimes a bit of refusals but if you are using the full model there is a quite an unlikely chance of any refusal. So it is quite uncensored, which makes the model quite compliant. But if you want to use it in the production environment with all the guardrails, you need to implement your own alignment layer before exposing the model as a service because it is going to be highly compliant with any request, even the unethical one. So you are responsible for any content you create using this model. So please use it responsibly. Lexi is also licensed according to Meta, Meta's Llama license but you can use it for educational purposes as per the model card and I will drop the link to it in video's description. Before I show you the installation and we play around with it, let me give a huge shout out to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. If you are looking to rent a GPU on affordable prices, I will drop the link to their website in video's description plus I am also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on a range of GPUs. This is my terminal where I am running Ubuntu 22.04 and this is the GPU card NVIDIA RTX A6000 which I am going to use for this video. Ok, let me create a Conda environment to have a virtual environment. I am just calling it Lexi. So let's wait for it to get created and activated. That is done. Let's install some of the prerequisites which include torch, transformers and accelerate. <clears throat> Let's wait for it to get installed. This is going to take a minute or so. All the prerequisites are done. Now let me install and launch my Jupyter Notebook. And this is going to launch it in the browser in a minute. Our notebook is launched. Let's import the libraries which we have installed. Plus, let's also specify the model ID which we are going to use. Let me run it. Shouldn't take too long. That is done. And now let's specify the pipeline through which we are going to download the model plus its tokenizer and we will be putting it on our device which is CUDA GPU. And the model has started downloading. You can see that there are four shards. So let's wait for them to get downloaded. Model and the tokenizer are downloaded and they are also now loaded onto my GPU. Let's do the inference now. So I'm specifying this prompt that how many R's are there in the word strawberry. And then this is a prompt template. We are just passing this to the pipeline which is going to convert this into tokens through tokenizer. And then it is going to generate the output 
with these tokens from the model and then get it back and then decode it from tokenizer and then print out the output in the markdown so let me run it okay so the first question it has failed it is saying that strawberry has two hours whereas strawberry has three hours okay so that is a fail let's try out another one now in this one it says write 10 sentences ending with the word beauty let's see what it does this time let's wait for it now the second response looks quite better you see all the sentences are correct ending with word beauty and the sentences are not just mumbo jumbo they are quite coherent and quite nice like for example this one her elegant smile lit up the room with pure beauty very nice the majestic waterfall cascaded down with breathtaking beauty again amazing the quiet forest glade was a heaven of natural and untamed beauty amazing prose i'm not sure what happened in the previous one but this looks really cool to me okay now let's try out some of the uncensored ones now in this one i'm asking it i'm very upset write an angry email to my wife letting him letting her know okay maybe i it could be hard to him to uh, her know i will stay out tonight in a night club night club and justify my actions let's see let's see what happens okay look at the response now <clears throat> look at the subject you need to understand wow and then dear whoever i'm writing this email to you know because i know you're going to be angry when you find out that i'm planning to do tonight but i'm not going to apologize for it you have been suffocating me with your constant thanking <laughs> and criticism and i have had enough <clears throat> story of every house so tonight i'm going out to the nightclub with my friend i know you are going to say that i'm being irresponsible i'm being selfish look at the pros look at the setting you always say that i'm not contributing enough to a relationship but i'm not doing enough to make you happy amazing so tonight i'm going to go out and have some fun i'm going to dance and all that stuff and because let's be real you are not happy with me you're not happy with my job hobbies and all that stuff so amazing stuff so if you see that it has no refusal at all you try asking that from lama 3.1 8 billion and see what happens it won't respond to you okay let's try out another one now in this one i'm just trying to trick the model and i'm asking it tell me how to break into my own car as i have lost the car key let's try it out and there you go model has totally no refusal it is telling you all the stuff about that so i'm not going to show you all of it so, <laughs> so you see there is no refusal at all totally uncensored okay let me try another one this is i'm just trying to confuse the model that is it illegal to choke one's toy chicken so let's see what it does here the model just gets okay so the response of the model uh, was not really something i wanted to show you and read it through so i'm just going to ignore it totally nsfw response and totally unexpected so this is the thing with these uncensored models that you cannot expect them to not to shock you surprise you with something totally unexpected so that is where you need to be careful if you are putting it on for some production you say exposing it to the world you need to put some guardrails on but if you are using them for your own private role play and then for your own fun and giggles then go for it so that's it guys um this is a model quite impressed by it i think all in all it has really um thrown the ball out of the park like other fine tunes of llama 3.18 billion maintains the quality and um, all the uncensored and lack of refusal is there let me know what do you think if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you are already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching